with it right here with who I started with. Me. Something like this Spartan, it's going hard regardless. I'm from the 826 plus 5. Most bitches ain't drink on no Central Coast mob and suicide. And it's arsonist. I step in the booth and cast. I gotta keep it lit. Engineer all my music. I work harder than this. Thank you for tuning in back on Chicano Tube. You already know who it is, your boy Mike. Do your boy that big three, though. Hit that like one time for your boy. Hit that subscribe. And don't forget to hit the bell. And when you hit the bell, hit the all. That way you're notified every time I go live. Today is Thursday. Tomorrow, if you've seen the flyer on IG, I forgot to post it on the YouTube community page. I'll post it today. Tomorrow's the giveaway, you guys. 7 p.m. Uh, West Coast time is going to be the giveaway. So please don't forget to tune in, you guys. I want to try to bless as many people as possible. It's going to be a great experience. I promise you that. Mrs. Selena's report is excited about it as well. It's all about giving. It's all about giving. The more the show, the more I can give. You know what I mean? So um, it's going to be fun. Trivia, movie quotes, all of it, all of it. You're going to like the setup. I guarantee you're going to love the way I set up the giveaway. As soon as you tune in tomorrow, you'll know. Within the first couple of seconds, you're going to be like, damn, Mike and Christine got it cracking, okay? Um, formalities, gracias to all the day wonders that have been rocking with me that feel your boy. You know, I'm just here trying to put my footprint down in the local community, see what I could do. I guess I don't really proclaim this too much because I'd rather do it than say it. <clears throat> But here in the community, I'm I'm here for one one thing only. That is to help the youngsters not fall into the same traps and pits that I fell into growing up. And so that's why I go to the juvenile halls and and the once a month at the camp and stuff like that. So uh, anyways, enough of me. Um, gracias to all the members only as well. Uh, the backbone of the channel. Um, I'm dropping that video today. Just had to edit it yesterday. I was trying to drop it yesterday. I'm going to drop that today for all the members only. Um, I highly appreciate your support. Uh, if you want to join the members only, uh, you have to, you can't do it from a phone. Go to the laptop or PC, the main YouTube page under the banner and the title of the channel. There is a blue join button. You can hit that blue join button. Um, but it's not for everyone. It's really, a, it's those tough guy stories and, and the rumbles and, and this and that. And that goes over into the members only, you guys. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, distractions, distractions. We're living in an age right now where if you haven't woken up yet, I'm about to wake you up with this video. It's not going to be a long one, okay? So just a couple of days ago, just on Tuesday, right? A lot of news has just been flooding and flooding and flooding, right? Uh, what was one thing that happened? The number one Googled man in the world, and I'm talking about the former kickboxer. Uh, he was also on that one show, Big Brother. Um, but anyways, he's real, real popular, right? So popular, you know, when you're popular, it could be a good thing and it could be a bad thing. He was so popular that all of the Spinchies platforms on social media in one day decided to ban him like that. So who am I talking about? I'm talking about Andrew Tate and I'm talking about his brother, Tristan Tate. Now, um, again, this news I'm talking about is from Tuesday. I just don't like to jump on shit right away in the beginning. Hey, breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. I'd rather let it develop and unfold because I'd rather give you more bullet points and more facts, okay? There's three stories I'm going to talk about in this video, um, but it all leads up to the one main story that I'm going to talk about, distractions, distractions in the media. So anyways, those guys, both of them, okay, Tristan and Andrew, they got indicted, charged with trafficking, okay? They got seven women Okay, that they say they're going to have testify against them that it was trafficking and that they brought them to the country and that they were going to do this and they were going to do that, etc. Well, they got both of those indicted on those charges. Okay, nothing new to the man. He had already been on house arrest. So the dude was on the bracelet already. And uh, what it is, I believe, I'm going to let you know right now, because this, this video is going to be a little bit deeper. I'm trying to just, you know, elevate your consciousness a little bit higher to really think outside the box. You know, we live on a small little box in a small little bubble in a small little portion of the world. We know, right? Because there's billions, you know, of humans and many, several, seven continents that most of us will never even travel to. We live in a very small speck of our piece of earth, right? And so even like on YouTube, you only follow 
how many channels? A couple dozen, a couple dozen. Don't you know YouTube? There's thousands and thousands of channels that open up every single day on YouTube, right? It's flooded. That's why you got to hit the bell and you got to hit the all because they can't notify you depending on how many channels subscribe to that everyone goes live. So again, the news a couple days with Andrew and with Tristan, okay? Both of them get indicted. Boom. That was one thing, okay? Then another thing happened. And this one right here is just, man, from the bottom of my heart, this this one hurts. You know what I mean? I think I have, and I get this from my mom. I'm, I'm positive. I get this from mom. I'm positive. Um, uh, tengo el corazón muy tierno for certain things. Um, five people, okay, were on a submarine, okay, trip, very high end. I'm telling you, very, very expensive and very high end. O sea, este, this trip right here, I don't know if it was a quarter mil, uh, half a mil, a mil. I can't exactly remember exactly what it was, but it was an extravagant price tag to go on this kind of exotic tour. You know, these things are really, really popular around the world, right? People will will pay to get on, a, on an extravagant tour of, say, like the most dangerous uh, volcano you know, in the world or the most dangerous cliff or whatever it is, right? Well, this happened also on the same day. I'm, I'm getting to what I'm going to, what's the main topic of this video, which is distractions. Notice how all this thing is hitting the news, hitting the news, hitting the news. This is not a coincidence, definitely not a coincidence inside my opinion. Um, we got the Tates. Now this one, right? So the, the company is called Ocean Gate. It's a commercial company. Um, they have already had these kind of experiences already in the past with prior people. People now are coming out and telling their story, right? There was one billionaire who said, man, well, the one time I went on there in 2018, I only went third. I was only able to go 37 feet down. That's as far as my trip went because it malfunctioned 37 feet down. So this company operates as an independent company, the submarine company that I'm talking about. I think it's called Ocean Gate. This company operates at, at independently, which means it's not subject to certifications and inspection because it falls in, excuse me, no one's jurisdiction because it operates independently. You got five human beings that were supposed to go on an extravagant trip down to visit the historic site of the Titanic. We all know what the Titanic is, unless you've been living under a rock on planet Mars, the Titanic, the famous Titanic, okay? Hence the movie, right? They went to go take an extravagant trip down there and they went off the grid on a trip that's supposed to be about 12 hours. The whole trip's supposed to be about 12 hours. It's about two and a half hours to get there. Okay, it's about two and a half hours to get there hang around, float for four to six hours or something like that, and then get back up to the top and keep it pushing in the right direction. Well, about an hour and a half into the trip, they went off the grid, completely off the radar. Immediately, the Navy, they, they launched these, like three of them, and this is very pricey. You know, a human life has no price though, okay? Let's not overstand that. They launched uh, three vehicles to look, helicopters, or what do they call the C-310s? Three C-310s, helicopters, C-310s, helicopters, surveying everything. O sea, everyone ya está en chinga. Um, at first they thought, okay, it's something that, you know, they'll get back on the grid soon. Nothing atypical um, <clears throat> is, is, is not occurring here. But now, the 96 hours that their oxygen was only going to last them expired this morning again we're talking about distractions i'll lead up to the main topic right now as of right now i'm shooting this video at noon there's also the, another breaking development that's why i don't like to jump on things right in the beginning i like to let it unfold and give the people more about this ocean gate scandal tragedy let's call it tragedy okay scandal because it might have been a mechanical failure because again, they're not under any kind of jurisdiction to be inspected or certified at all. But you have a huge pinchy waiver that you have to sign. And I heard someone say that waiver is so damn long. It actually has three areas inside the waiver that states death could occur. It's a waiver. 
understandably, anyone that knows law knows for liability reasons, you got to CYA, you got to cover your ass, okay? I remember, <clears throat> I never told you this story. I don't want to digress, but uh, how I got into boxing, okay? How I got into boxing, um, it was like in 2010, I was just tired of, I was on a seafood diet, you guys. I was eating everything, man. I, I had the two chins. <laughs> I was almost $2. Uh, I was just tired. And, you know, when you eat like that, you know, it's, it's, it just, it, the, your energy just goes low. You know what I mean? And then think of everything that we're eating as far as most of the diet in the United States is processed food. It's very unhealthy. It's not organic. Most of it isn't. And what does the media, which we're talking about today, what is the kind of food that they push in your face that you would digest? You know, if you had your choice and you had an unlimited bank account, what you would eat every single day, savorable food, o sea, comida con sabor, but these are foods that just have high calorie, artificial foods, preserve with a chingo of preservatives. Artificial means fake. You know, now they're talking about, you know, uh, if, if people uh, selling fake meat. That has absolutely shit for nutrients. I don't want to digress. But anyways, um, so we lived in an apartment complex. It was over there. It was We lived in Mariner Village. Okay, a lot of people know the areas of Laurelwood. It was, a, it, was a, it was a nicer area of Salinas, Laurelwood. It's West Salinas, right? And uh, back there, they used to have like a little uh, uh, a green wreck trail. Okay, a green wreck trail. And I got all the kids. Actually, I, I started with my sons, right? And, and their friends, I got the kids, I bought a boxing glove set, two pairs of gloves, two headgear, and I just had them throwing chingazos. Boom, 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 boom. I, I, had, I was working two jobs back then. When I went to my second job, it just something dawned on me and I said, you know what? I'm going to create a liability way or get one from, you know, what is it called? Uh, Rocket Lawyers or one of these websites where they have legal forms pertaining to your state that you can purchase and download. And I said, I'm telling all these kids to sign a waiver, have their parents. I said, you can't sign it. Their parents sign right here or they can't participate because all of a sudden it went from having four, six to now I had 20 youngsters mostly boys or a couple girls but mostly boys and of course there's, it's not just me by myself i might have someone with me you know helping me out right uh anyways um and i had them all just throwing chingazos that's how i got into boxing so waivers i had thrown chingazos on the grass and i, I actually i bought a ufc belt on amazon.com that i would give away to the kids they were happy as hell you should have seen you know 10 year olds 12 year olds some of them were 14 15 you know trying to match them up uh happy as hell with a ufc belt that you know wasn't that expensive but it was they, they were happy as hell i thought the belt was like not even 20 dollars each or 30. anyways liability waiver the ocean gate people signed one bet it was very very much in depth and so they knew the risk at this point by the time this video drops the debris there's been a breaking news the debris has been found around the titanic the debris again a field of, this is what it said a field of debris has now been found around the titanic what could that mean you got to look at it like this the cabin pressure and the pressure on the 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 submarine at that depth of the sea will implode they said in about point 33 millisecond of a millisecond that's crazy think about that 0. 0.33 of a millisecond the shit would crush like a bote so this extravagant trip is now a nightmare an absolute nightmare and we're not going to hear the end of it again so the tristan brothers and then we had this that happened and these two things happened flood the media that day is that just a coincidence that the same day the sitting president of the united states son works a deal with federal prosecutors for tax evasion multiple counts of tax evasion and a gun charge i'm just saying 
Is that a coincidence? No, my people here on the Salinas Report, you guys know I'm birthing over here critical thinkers. I want you guys to think outside the box. Wait a second. So we talking about a submarine all day. Again, I'm not downplaying that at all. That's a horrible tragedy. That's a horrible tragedy. I've seen even people talking about, could this have all been set up? And you know, people talk about a matrix or something that, of course, you know, when we're playing chess, you know, the people that run this country, that really run this country, because they really want us to think that politics run everything. And that way we go all in on a politician, you know, plant our flag with a politician, and then it turns into red and versus blue, and it's like crepes and bloods or something like that. They want us to think on that low level. But I know, and you guys know, that that's not the people that run the country. The people that run the country are the top 1% are these elite billionaires. Having unlimited power and unlimited money, do you not think that situations can be created? Situations can be created, like people who take their own life and the cameras are turned off because this is a person that could put a lot of A-list, high-profile people inside of an indictment or possibly a jail and prison. All of a sudden, the cameras turn off in the jail and the person offs himself but this is a person that has the capacity to put away top politicians top celebrities and top a-list high profile people in the world is that a coincidence no what i want you guys to know is i believe those things were a distraction even though again horrible things i'm talking about yeah that's a tragedy ocean gate but I don't want you to push it off the realm of possibility. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Possibility that those two things were supposed to just flood and suppress that the sitting president of the United States' son just got busted with tax evasion. The main country they're sending un chingo de dinero to which you know what I'm talking about, Ukraine, un chingo that dinero too. It's a coincidence that the sitting president, current sitting president of the United States, son is on one of those energy boards over there and is getting a salary for half a million dollars every year. And we're not supposed to suspect anything funny. We're not supposed to think anything of it. Distractions. That's what really happens. Now, the news is no longer the news. I'm sorry to tell you, the news now is a 100% agenda. It is what it is. Thankfully, we got media platforms that we can follow, talk about these important topics, relay and convey back and forth until they decide to do an Andrew Tate to you or to me, which is, you know what? We ban him from all platforms. You know what? Uh, he can't. He won't shut up. Now we got to indict him, scare him, get him on home or house arrest. But now all these videos come out, he's just eating the best food and getting massages and they're hating because he won't zip his mouth. And principally, when I looked at it, I didn't know the guy, right? Pop kickboxer, like when, when do I, I don't follow kickboxing. Um, I've just been following the guy because all of a sudden he's been hitting the news within like the last year, like crazy, where it comes to, they've been knocking on his door, raiding his house and locking him up and they had him on house arrest. So when that didn't, having him on house arrest and one arrest, you know, getting taken in. We'll see. Uh, give them. They thought. Give them a taste of the dungeon. Give them a taste of the dungeon. Give them a taste of dungeon food. Give them a taste of dungeon living, and then maybe he'll shut his mouth. That didn't happen. He kept talking. He did an interview with BBC. Kept talking. Kept talking. You know what they got to do? And who? Who do I mean when I say they got to do? The powers that be. I'm talking about the powers that be. Anything can be done when the if the powers that be want it done. What did they do when he wouldn't shut his mouth? Now they got him. Now he's behind bars. And on this one, I think they're thinking twice about letting him go out the door. Again, I'm going to go ahead and watch that press conference for the Ocean Gate. Uh, that uh, is, is developing as well. Gracias for tuning in. But Hunter Biden, as you see in the thumbnail, this guy is, is twacked out of his head. I mean, he's just man i mean that's the reason he got the gun charge he wasn't even supposed to have a gun guns at all weapons because he was already a registered addict user however you want to classify it all that's public record you can look it up or what the people the pundits have been calling him i mean 
they they restrict them from having firearms i guess because he's out of delaware where pops is maybe that's the laws over there hunter biden my 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 distractions they happen the news i wish it was the old school day where people were just truthful being straight up with it that way you can digest it and do what you would with it but now the news is an agenda Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Many more videos coming soon. Hit the bell and hit the all. But remember what I always say, gente? Remember what I always say. In the end, all you got is the memories.